Hey everyone, welcome to our class on Socrative today. Sorry I couldn't be at the high school. Uh, had a meeting that I have to go to, so we will get started. Um, my goal by the end of class today is for all of you to be able to walk out of here uh, registered for Socrative and then for all of you to be able to use any of its features uh, at any time, whether you're in a computer lab or you're just using your students' mobile devices. So let's get started. Uh, the first screen that you're going to come to when you go to uh, Socrative is this screen. It's either going to ask you to sign in or it's going to have you register. Uh, the website that you need to go to to get here is t.socrative.com. You can see that up the top. You might want to write that down somewhere. But t.socrative.com. I know it's not the website that uh, comes up after you go there. I know it says m.socrative.com slash lecture. But that is uh, the address that will redirect you to this website. So for everyone here, I'm assuming that we have not registered before. So we'll click on register. And then you'll go ahead. I would use your Tri Creek email address. Uh, and then type in a password and that will register you for the site. So go ahead and take some time real quick and uh, you can have anyone pause the video and I'll come back once we've all registered. Now hopefully that we've all registered, uh, we'll go ahead and I'm going to sign in to my account. And you will see here in the main screen this is what your account looks like. Um, some important things that you need to look at. You'll see right here my room number and my room number is 8451. You will have a unique room number uh, for yourself. It will also show you active users in the room. Uh, right now I've only got one. I have four devices here that I'm going to uh, register to the room and I will show you how to have your students register to the room. Uh, you'll see now I should uh, be coming up on three devices in the room. Um, but this is your main screen here. You'll see that you can choose multiple choice, true, false, short answer, start a quiz, exit ticket, space race. We will go all over all of these in the next few videos. Um, important thing to start off with is registering your students to your room. So what you will do is you will have your students. I'm going to log out real quick uh, from this site. Hopefully it logs out. If not, I'll just go to M. You'll have your students go to the site m.socrative.com. So m.socrative.com, and it will ask them to just join a room number. So they will type in your room number and then join the room. And now they'll come to this screen. They'll see that either on their iPad, an iPhone, or an iPod Touch, any Android device, anything that has a connection to the Internet, they can get to. So if you're in a computer lab, this is a great system to use as well. Um, so, once you have them logged into a room, uh, you can go ahead and start doing uh, multiple choice quizzes, true, false, just to get the feel of your class. And we will go over all these other options in the videos to come. So, hopefully, every picked up on some of that. We should all be registered now and in the site. Uh, I will have a few more videos to go through for this class, and then there might be some other videos that uh, the facilitators can give you the links to and then you should be able to go back and check those out at any point in time just as a quick refresher if you're going to use this in your class.